everyone very good morning and good evening today we will go through how you can use sap.thinkexam.com for the sap certification exam preparation so it is a tool where basically you can go and subscribe for the different module test series and prepare for the certification exam with the practice questions so let's see so when you will be logging into the sap.thinkexam.com you will find this window here where basically you need to, to enroll first you need to give your email address and set up a password okay so we'll go to the new registration we need to give name i'll give one email address and set one password Confirm password. Phone number. And we need to select a group. In the group, there's only one option. We need to select SAP as a group. Then we need to select a country. This is a country we are selecting India. And we can go to the register now. So when you will be entering, you will be seeing some of the sample tests here. So there is one sample test available for the sales here. So you can go ahead and give the sample test. But in this sample test, you will be getting only that how the questions uh, would be appearing. Okay, the results would not be shown in the sample test. It will only show what kind of questions you can go ahead with. If you have any questions, you can give a call on this number. So this is the email which you can use to write if you have any questions or queries. So if you want to see what kind of products it has, you need to go into the buy product. Here you will see all different kind of test series which you have, which is available here right now. The three test series are available. So if you want to give exam for activate, there's a test series available here, which is having a nine test. Then for implementation scenarios for manufacturing, for sales and procurement right now the five test series are available here which you can go through and each of the test series has a multiple number of tests so if you want to go ahead and see what what kind of different tests are available so let's say for example we go ahead uh, in this sourcing and procurement so it will give you a detail that what you, you are going to get in this test series so you can purchase with this amount this test series and it would be a su subscription for three months and it includes these kind of tests. So the good thing is that it, you can go ahead with the full 80 question test here. So this is a full 80 question test as it happens in uh, SAP, you can give that test. You can go with the mini test, sourcing and procurement related mini test, you can give it from here. If you are on the go, if you want to access it through uh, mobile application, you can download the mobile application of SAP Think Exam and uh, think exam and there you can access sap.thinkexam.com with your credentials you would also be able to access the test on the mobile application so this will be the uh, the test which comes from the question bank so there is a huge question bank which has been prepared by the sap experts and from that question bank whenever you take that test it puts up the questions randomly on this question bank and then you would be giving a test from there. Apart from this full test, uh, mini test, 80 questions, 10 questions, or we also have a 40 question test. Apart from that, you would also be able to give a topic wide test here. So let's say this is a uh, master data and organization structure. If you want to practice, you can go ahead with this test. If you want to practice uh, inventory management related topic, you can give this test. You want to practice your valuation and account determination you can give this test so the topics wise test is also available so we can go ahead and uh, uh, see that how you can subscribe for it so to subscribe for this test series then i will show you that how you, we can give a mini test from here the five question test and how you can see the results out of it so i click on the buy product if you have any coupon you can apply it here if you have a paypal account you would be able to 
you would be able to pay through the PayPal account. Okay, if you don't have a PayPal account, you can click it here, pay with debit or credit card directly. So by clicking here, you will be able to do the payment. So here you need to give your details, your billing address details, your credit card or debit card, whatever you want to use. You can use it from here and then you would be able to pay it. So once you pay for this test, then this test would be appearing in your my test. So I will directly take you to back and we'll see once you complete this details, how the test would be appearing. So once you have procured for the test, uh, all of the tests would be appearing here into your my test box. So in, in my text, now you have all of the sourcing and procurement related tests, which was available in that test series are now available here. So you can go ahead and start any of these tests. So uh, you can see here that uh, we are having a time here that validity time for that test and the duration that what would be the duration number of questions are uh, available in the within the uh, test heading itself so for an example we'll be going with the uh, uh, mini test five questions so this is a sap s4 hana procurement mini test five questions which uh, come from the uh, pool of the multiple questions this five questions will be picked and the duration of the test is 10 minutes we'll click on the start test the system would be checking the compatibility of the browser so here the instructions are there which you need to follow okay so these are the instructions given here it's a more or less kind of a same kind of a test which you will be giving when you go through the certification but it has only five questions you have a similar kind of 80 question test also you can click here i have read and understood the instructions then we can click on the next once you click on the next your uh, exam will start here so we have a first question the clock has been started it's a 10 minute test you would be only having the 10 minutes to give it this is the questions in the gray which means you have not attempted it you can see unattempted once you will attempt it the color will change so i've just put this answer then I have gone into the so this question it mentioned they are the two correct answers which we need to select so just I'm mentioning these two answers if I want to review this question I can also click on review your question then save and next so you can see here there's a different icon here so that you want to review it you can come back and review it then I will just mention some answer this has a two correct answer and this is how. so once we have completed it if you want to review anything you can go here and get it reviewed your questions you can come back and once the test has been completed you can click on submit test system will be asking whether you want to submit yes submit it so with this submission system shows that your result is two marks out of 10 which is 20 percent so it also says that need more practice better luck next time means we got feel with this exam total questions it shows you the question analysis what were the question analysis how many questions we have attempted how many has been corrected and how many has been wrong you can go here with the detailed analysis for scorecard your subject report solution report question report so we'll be going to the question report the question report will be showing us that what are the questions we have made it as a correct what was the correct answer and what was our answers and how much time we have taken to answer that question that would be displayed here in the question report now here we'll be going into the solution report to check what is the right solutions so here system shows that uh, what was the correct answer what answer you have made it and system also shows you the solution in solution it will be mentioning some kind of a hint that why this inventory management is the correct answer so the solution would not be available for all of the questions uh, but for many of the questions the solutions would be available uh, you can if you have any doubt on any question you can write an email to contact.s4.hana at uh, gmail.com and then from there also you can get the explanation so a set of uh, sap experts keep on working on the question bank and the pool questions where they keep on reviewing the questions and adding these kind of solutions and hints so that you you can know that why this answer is correct why this option is correct
so we can see the another thing in some cases you will also get some screenshot in the explanation that uh, why the answer which has been mentioned is correct so you can review your answers here in the report you can see uh, what is the right solution for it and why it is right so this is how the uh, this sap.thinkexam.com works so right now it has a limited test series available a team is working on to add more test series next test series will be available for finance and then for abap right now only five test series are available which you can go ahead and subscribe it as i have shown thank you for watching this video bye bye for now Thank you.